Hey guys and welcome back to a brand new Nandroid unboxing. In the last episode we unboxed Nandroid Beatrice I suppose. So in this video we'll be opening Nandroid Ram. Not to be confused with best girl Ram. Personally I don't really like Ram in the show. But I'm on a quest to get them all. And to be honest, you can do some poses with Ram and Rem together. So if you get Rem, you kinda need to get Ram too. That's a smart business move. <laughs> Ouch my wallet. Anyway, let's see what she comes with and if it's worth to pick one up for yourself. And here we have Ram in the box. The box looks super, super cute. I just always love the fact that they include like the base color of the character on the side. All the poses, as you can see, if you own both of them, you can do like a special pose, which is really cool. We won't be seeing this pose in this episode, but we will figure out the pose in next episode, which is going to be unboxing Rem. Without further ado, let's jump straight into this figure. So, first thing I noticed about the packaging, last time when we opened the Beatrix, the first thing I noticed was that the package was super heavy. This one is super light in comparison. So that's already a good sign for posing, I suppose. And here we have Ram out of the box, like always with Good Smile Company, the attention to detail is absolutely amazing i always love it how detailed all the characters look she has a lot of articulation like you can twist this around a little bit if you want to the arms of course and they also have an extra joint that allows you to basically move the wrist but at her arm uh, of course the head has all the nandroid movements and i just ah, oh, the hair is so well done I love it and for some reason if you are into that you can remove this thing. Looks a lot less rem all of a sudden does it? That said, Nandroids always come with a lot and a lot of accessories. Let's see what Ram comes with. So first of all she comes with this completely useless arm unless you buy rem. This is the hand that they use in the pose together. And this immediately brings one question. Does Rem come with this arm or only Ram? Hmm, I wonder. We have to see next week, I guess. But still, it's a very interesting arm. But if you don't own Rem, it's pretty much useless. Next up, we have a very cool one. Ram holding a plate because of course she is a maid so she has a lot of work to do and the fact that they actually included like a dinner plate or like a baking plate is super cool because i mean you can't have a maid without at least one kind of chore that i gotta do we also got this really weird bent arm i'm not sure what it's used for but it's probably for one of the poses it looks actually kind of cool, but, but once again, at this moment in time, I have no idea what it's used for. So that is a surprise. You never get two bent legs, but Ram actually comes with two bent legs. That's really cool. I guess these are for the poses where she like has her, her leg like bent for the pose with Ram. And because they are just like not the same size, I am guessing that one will be used for Rem and the other one for Ram. But I am not sure about that. This is probably the weirdest item I have ever gotten with an android. A hand holding a potato. I wouldn't say the potato is the most iconic thing about Ram. But there is a scene in which she's holding a potato, so... I guess that's cool. No idea why they thought, yes, we need a potato, but... I mean, getting a potato is always cool, I suppose. 
And we also get this awesome little hand with a knife. Of course, just to clean the potato. She's not going around murdering people with the knife. Or is she? Ooh, step, step. In my opinion, there was always one item that an android comes with that is basically the premium accessory. The accessory that they put the most effort in. And for Ram, I believe that is this. These are wind particles for when she uses wind magic in the show. One little, like, nitpick, I think. I have no idea how to pose these. Um, but we'll see about that. There's probably, like, an instruction on how to pose these. Because they got, like, no joint and I can't make them magically fly, so... <laughs> Maybe you actually need to use wind magic to put these on this place. Hmm. Like every Nandroid, Ram comes with different faces. The first face that she has is the face she is wearing right now. And this is the face that basically screams Ram. The uninterested, I don't care face. I love this face. Like if you see this face, you instantly think of Ram. So it was the logical choice to include this. Another absolute classic Ram face is the angry face. During the poses, you will also use this face for when you do an attacking pose. So that's kind of cool. I absolutely love the fact that they included this face, as it's also one of Ram's iconic faces. But the last face? That was a surprise, like an actual surprise. A happy Ram? <laughs> That's kinda rare. I am happy they included it though, as it makes her look a lot more cute. But she doesn't use this face that much in the show, I can tell you that. It's always nice to get a face that really is like the rare face of the character, so that's kinda cool. I still absolutely love it. Anyway, let's take a look at all the poses you can do with Ram. Let's go! Hey guys, so I am posing right now and you see this awesome pose. So you know that meme that's like, Mom, can we get a Ram? And she's like, oh, we already got a Ram at home. And then it's like, Ram at home. Like, um... I always hate these particle effects, just for the fact that, look at all the stands, dude. Ah, that sucks, dude. Like, all the stands really suck. Yeah. I'm just not a fan of, like, all the, all the plastic, but hey, I mean, for me, that just probably means I will not use this pose, but if you are a fan of these attack particles, then by all means, uh, use it. Whoosh. 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 All in all, I really enjoyed opening this figure. She looks absolutely amazing. And as weird as it sounds, I'm gonna pose her in the potato pose where she like is like cutting the potato. I think it looks absolutely adorable. And that's probably how she will be spending most of her time until I'm going to repose again. I would say it's a little bit of a shame that she comes with so many parts that you can't use unless you got RAM. But nonetheless, she's absolutely amazing and I'm super happy to put her to my collection. Super cool. But anyway guys, if you liked this video and want to see more, please hit that like and subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye!